It's the home opener for your Rockford Ice Hogs out at BMO Center as they take on a familiar foe in the Chicago Wolves. Hello, everybody. Joseph Zakszewski once again with you, joined alongside the captain of your Ice Hogs and Garrett Mitchell. Garrett, the home opener always special every season, no matter if it's your first or if you're a veteran like yourself and you've seen a couple in your heyday. But the energy in this room has to be palpable going into a matchup like this. Yeah, we're excited. It's uh, obviously it's fun to play uh, at home in front of our own crowd and. Uh, you know, there's been a lot of renovations to the, to the building, um, obviously the Jumbotron being, uh, being the first and, and you know, we're, we're excited. We've got, uh, we've put together a team that, you know, we all feel like uh, we can have a lot of success this year and we're excited for that. Kind of walk us through some of these new bells and whistles. You talked about the new scoreboard, new LED boards as well. There's going to be a block party here tonight, changes up on the concourse. As a player, I know you're focused on the game, the 60-minute effort and everything like that, but do little touches like a new scoreboard or something kind of, you know, get the energy up level a little bit? For sure, yeah. I mean, anytime you go into a building, uh, it's, uh, you know, it's nice to be able to look up sometimes, it's, uh, whether the puck's in the corner, you can look up uh, on the Jumbotron and kind of see what's going on. So, um, no, we're excited. The, the new lights in the building, um, obviously the suites for, for the fans and, and everything else. So, um, you know, I think there's a buzz around the city. Um, like I said, we're excited for this year. We've, we've put to, together a team that we feel uh, we can have a lot of success with, and, and uh, we're excited for that. Well, the Rockford Ice Sox taking on a familiar foe in the Chicago Wolves in their home opener. Before we get to that, already two games in your back pocket. What have you learned as the captain of this team about this team? I know going into the season you were expecting a high-paced, high-energy group, but two games in, their, in, your, in the back pocket and already some uh, records up, up on the scoreboard. What have you seen so far? Yeah, I think for us, it's our young guys you know, have taken that next step. And, um, you know, we've put... Uh, in the offseason, they've, they've gone out and we've gone out and got some, some guys that have proved themselves in this league and, and uh, you know, our young prospects coming in. So I like our group. I'm really, really excited, uh, you know, for the season to get going here and, and kind of get into, uh, you know, the thick of it. But, um, you know, we're, we're still early. Uh, I'm not going to make any predictions uh, as of yet other than, uh, you know, we want to play as long as we can. Well, the Wolves, no strangers. The Rockford Ice Dogs, Garrett, you've seen them a lot. A good playoff battle against them last year. 12 meetings in the regular season. It seems like every year when it comes down to, to a rivalry matchup and when you look around the American Hockey League, this is probably one of the best rivalries that you can see, the I-90 rivalry and, and the battle for Illinois. What do you expect in, in this rivalry this season? You had their number last year, but again, players come and go. Different things change over the years. What do you expect in, in this version's season's version of the rivalry. Yeah, I, you know, it, it definitely is going to be a little bit different. Obviously, they've uh, gone through a coaching change and, um, you know, anytime, anytime you win, um, you know, there's always changes, right? So, you know, it's not to say it, it's still the same organization, um, but at the same time, there's, there's definitely going to be different pieces. So we're going into it just like we would any other game. Um, you know, we've got to worry about ourselves before uh, we get too far into it. But, you know, we're going to play them 12 times this year. So there's going to be a, there's going to be a lot of video sessions that we'll have down the road here. Ice Hogs with two games already, a one and one record, so already their victory, but looking to get the home opener victory. The Wolves 0-2, oh does that play a factor in terms of energy level and, and what you expect and what are going to be the biggest keys in, in your mind going into tonight? Yeah, I, I think for us it's obviously we started on the road, um, you know, in Winnipeg, and, and that's Winnipeg's a great team. We've got them here coming tomorrow, and, um, you know, I, I think for us it's it's just worrying about ourselves. We've Like I said, we've... We are still very young. Um, we've got to learn to, to play without the puck. We've got a lot of guys that, that can play with the puck, and uh, those guys have proven themselves throughout the years um, of playing in this league. So, um, like I said, it's just it's playing the right way without it. Um, we're going to get our chances, and, and we, uh, we believe in that group that we have in there to, to put the puck in the back of the net. So we're excited for it. I think, uh, you know, I always say control what you can control. The other stuff will kind of fall into a place for us. Garrett, I appreciate it. Good luck tonight. Thank you. The captain for your Rockford Ice Hogs, Garrett Mitchell, joining us on the Hogs Broadcast Network, presented by BMO. Let's get you back to the action. You're listening and watching Rockford Ice Hogs Hockey, presented by BMO.